Tonight, our final three will be bound out for the grand prize of $500,000. Who has what it takes to win? Will it be Digi, the YouTuber from Iowa? Killer, the pizza delivery man from Canada? Or will it be Smooth, the engineer from Ohio? Who will be crowned the winner and take home $500,000? Welcome to the season one finale of Big Brother Minecraft. This season on Big Brother Minecraft, seven strangers moved in for a chance to win $500,000. Among them was a digital artist, a YouTuber, a graphic designer, a varsity track star, an assassin, a BBMC6 alumni, and a pizza delivery man. After Decked, the gamer moved in, Charge, Digi, Lozy, and Smooth enter for a second chance. After Jay was evicted from a competition, the house nearly voted unanimous. Charge, Timo, <laughs> Danny, MacArthur, Lulzy, yeah. you have been evicted from the Big Brother house. After Killer was evicted by a unanimous vote of the season, Killer, you have been evicted from the Big Brother house. He then re-entered the game and became the new head of household. Go to hide, Lulzy. Oh, but oh, oh, yeah, yeah. After Killer re-entered the game, Kirby and his rival, Death, were evicted with the house nearly voted unanimous. After Killer became the new head of household, he targeted the Triple Threat Alliance. After Killer won the final veto and decided not to use it, Digi had no choice to cast his sole vote, and JP was evicted and became the sixth member of the jury. Tonight, the final three will bow it out in a three-part head of household, and who will be the last jury member? Nine house guests have departed, and seven jury members will make a decision. And who will be crowned the winner and take home $500,000? And who did you vote for favorite house guests? Find out tonight on the season one finale of Big Brother Minecraft. Good evening, my name is Robert Palin and welcome to the finale of Big Brother Minecraft Season 1. It is Day 57 inside the Big Brother Minecraft house, and the final three will be facing the three-part Head of Household competition. Who has what it takes to win the $500,000 grand prize? You'll find out soon enough. But first, after JP was evicted, Digi, Killer, and Smooth talked about their favorite moments before they go into the first part of the Head of Household competition. Front door. Grace. You may now cast your sole vote to event. Oh my god, I've never had the <laughs> opportunity I'm to sure. make a sole vote. Um, JP, Smooth, I just want to say it's been a blast playing with the two of you. <clears throat> um, I have been working with the two of you for a while now. And this is very hard. Oh no. Um, That's true, she said. And <laughs> I <laughs> um, hope to the person who I am voting, I hope you understand that I wish I didn't have to make this decision, but I do. <sighs> JP, I'm sorry, I vote to evict you. Oh, yeah. Right. Okay. Make that too small. JP, you've been evicted from the Big Brother house. Oh, my JP. I'm sorry, <laughs> JP, I really am. It's okay. Dude, I'm saying this right now, even though I may have bad feelings towards you, that was a great rivalry. <laughs> oh, oh my god, I made final three. I can't believe this. I went from being second out on the test of season to actually making it final three. Can I win any of the final head of household competitions to make final two? I really hope I can. Or at the very least, I hope Smooth can win. If I can't, because then he will get out killer. Anything can happen this week. It's more important to win now more than ever. You know, guys, I can't believe we've made it this far into the... We are the final three. Oh, my God. It? Yeah. We beat out, like, nine other people just to get to this spot. But, and, like, holy f I thought I was... 
time ago. I know. What was your guys' favorite moment from the house? What are you guys looking at me? <laughs> <laughs> all of this, all of this was a blur. But like, other than you know, oh, getting out, JT, JP. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> and the house. I would say first going into the house because I was really excited to play this game. Mm -hmm. I didn't think how fucking hard it would be. Be yeah. after like you know, not having anybody to be in an alliance with, but I feel like walking first into those houses, into those doors. Seeing like all these people was my favorite moment. No, I loved how like me and Killer went back and forth as competition wins. It was just like me and Killer. <laughs> <laughs> Com wins. Yeah. And every single time that I was in a competition, JP would be like, Go smooth, go smooth, go smooth. And I'm like, Okay, it's all on me again. <laughs> yeah. This JP always banked on me mm -hmm. to win. My favorite moment was honestly meeting all of you guys and forming the Triple Threat Alliance, alliance <laughs> that I stuck by. No, no, it should have been okay. carrots, I'm telling you. It should have been carrots. Well, Triple Threat, if you guys were threats, then why aren't you all three of you here? Well, you know we would have been, but you came back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> and well, I mean, why did it up? I mean, like, if we see how. We knew the alliance. I basically was competitions. JP was something. And Ninji was more of the social guy. Yeah. JP was like the guy that was there. Yeah, he was he was that <laughs> guy just to make it. He was, he was that extra number, I guess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the one <extra. laughs> It was so hard voting him out, but I just couldn't bring him with me because I didn't know if I could trust him fully. I mean, you probably would have taken out Killer, to be honest. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but it sucks that he's gone. Yeah. But it's also happy that he's gone because we are the final three. Mm -hmm. We all had unique strategies, and those strategies helped us get this far. Yeah, I feel, I feel like out of all the people in this game, the best three came. Yeah. The yeah. comeback, the... The uh, two attorneys. Wait, you guys. Oh, f you guys already. <laughs> 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 well, I knew I was yep, going to work with the attorneys. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What place did you get again, Diddy? I got second boot. <laughs> wow, alright. Smooth, you got what place? Fifth. Okay, well, you can both beat your original places. Let's see if you guys can get second. Well, uh, good luck, guys. It's gonna gonna come down to this <laughs> Oh, uh, I'll be disappointed. <laughs> Let's get no. It's probably it's, it's like if I don't win HOH, I'm probably third. So, All right. Well, let's see how the final HOH goes, and good luck to you yeah. too. Yep. Let's head to the backyard. I guess we got all we have to do now is just head outside to see who wins the first part. Yeah. Yep. Good luck That's to the only one. part that we have to get past right now is final HOH. I wonder who's gonna win. Alright. And be the sole okay. vote to evict someone. Yeah, let's, Good luck, let's go. Good luck, everyone. When we come back, the final three will be facing the three parts head of household. You do not want to miss this. Stay with us. Welcome back to Big Brother Minecraft. The final three are ready for the first part of the Head of Household competition, where one of them will advance to part three. Red. Hey, are you guys are you guys be able to flip levers? I can. Did you just? Okay, okay. Okay, are you guys ready? No. Too bad! You need <laughs> three, two, one, go!
Done. Gil, the pizza delivery man, won the first part of the head of household competition. Now, Digi and Smooth will face each other in part two, where one of them will be facing Killer in part three. Two of the head of household competition. This is called memory lane. Here's how it's gonna work. When I say go, you who got in the chest in front of you contains the head of the past house guest that well, should I say evicted house guests, and you have to remember them in order. Seriously, remember them in order. Oh, wait, am I in it? Wait, am I in it? Evicted. The first person, and what, if you think you have it right, go over to the command block and press the button that says if you want to check. And now, and, and I'll be checking of who is right. The person who got the the head in the correct order of the eviction will win part two and will face killer in the final part of the head of household does everyone dab yeah <laughs> yeah i get it i i don't get it but i don't need to <laughs> smooth and digi you may now begin in three two one go Smooth wants to check. Oh. <laughs> Smooth? You've won part two of the head of house and competition. Yeah, by the way, JP messaged me, but I didn't use it. Smooth, the engineer, won part two of and will be facing Killer in part three. When we come back, Jay sat down with the jury and discussed about the final three. And then, Killer and Smooth will face each other in part three. You do not want to miss this. Stay with us. Welcome back to Big Brother Minecraft. Even though Jay was evicted from the competition on day one, he sat down with Danny, MacArthur, Lulzy, Kirby, Deck, and JP, and they will be discussing about our final three. So guys, it's the final three. Um, we, as you know, we are here to discuss the final three, but we can't really do that until we know who the final three is. So. Who do you guys think was just evicted in fourth place? Um, I'm not quite sure. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's go with that. Maybe he got out. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh. <laughs> 
much. All right, well, we got some very insightful commentary here tonight. Let's see who really was just evicted in fourth place. Come on out. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh. JP. Yeah, it was me. <laughs> I didn't want to go home, but like, I mean, yeah, it had to happen, I guess. Yeah, nobody was, I mean, nobody I mean, wanted to go home. I mean, or to the jury house. What happened? As in, who um, had a power cold? Um, well, um, let's say, um, the worst turnout one HOH, no, it's killer. Let's just say that. Um, and then, um, he nommed me and smooth for eviction, and he won a POV, which also sucked. And, like, as soon as that happened, um, it was down to me to move back on the block, and Digi had the deciding vote, and he chose to save smooth, so then I went home. And Wait. Then, yeah. I'm sorry, I, like, zoned out. Okay, who decided to save smooth? Oh, um, D Digi. Okay. Yeah, he just nommed me, and then I mean, so, uh, Killer nommed me. Then, yeah, Killer won POV. So, Let's start with a question for you. Why do you think uh, Digi decided to vote you out over Smooth? He literally had the sole vote. I think he um, voted Smooth out over me because he was closer to Smooth, and that like he you actually mean, was working with the other way in the game. Huh? I said you mean the other way around. You said you voted. He voted Smooth out over you. Oh, I mean, I think he voted me out over Smooth because, um, <laughs> did he was cl aligned with You're Smooth, blocking. like he was closer to, he, uh, he was closer, oh my gosh, I, uh, uh, he was closer with Smooth throughout the game, and I feel like he just thought I was there, so, I mean, he knew he, there's only final two, so I mean, like, if he's closer to Smooth, he'd take me out. So, Master Fi. Yeah. <laughs> You've been out of the house for a little bit. Uh, when you left, how how are the dynamics setting in? Like social dynamics. Where do you think the alliance is? Um, I don't. Honestly, I think this is just a load of bull that I got voted out uh, against uh, Smooth. I just don't think it was really smart. So uh, whoever that one person to vote to save me, thank you. Um, the rest of you are dumb and idiots. That's all I got to say. I'm not okay. Nice. Nice. <laughs> anyway. So, now that we know who the final three is, we can start discussing their merits and if they deserve to win the game. So, we can start out with our first member of the final three. Killer. Um, battles way back into the house after being evicted and has been very dominant in comps lately. What do you guys think about him? Um... I think Killer play has played a pretty, pretty basic game. I mean, um, he came into the game, started stirring the pot as soon as he got there, because he started throwing me under the bus with you. And I feel like he was playing a pretty good social game <laughs> until, until the part when um, he tried to, to vote make me vote against Smooth, and then right out on there he went against me, and then pretty much didn't have a social game after that. He just kept throwing money under the bus with Smooth, wasn't really benefiting him at all. But and then um, we got him out, and he came back, and all he did was win comps. Not and he kept. He didn't really have any other strategy after that, he, other than win comps to survive. Because he didn't have anyone, he didn't ever strategize with anyone. He was just there winning comps. Yeah. I mean, I feel like. I mean, I I I'm gonna you know, try to not be salty, even though I just was a second ago. Um, but you know, I mean, the fact that killer got back into the game and is still in there is proving that he's not wasting his second chance so you know we you know i i applaud him because i don't know what would have happened if like i managed to get in the game so i don't know i think that we should definitely look at that that he is not wasting his opportunity and he really was there to really is there because he wants to win the game all he did was win comps but I mean, like, that's, you know, sometimes you're in a situation and if anything, I don't blame him because, you know, when you come back into the house after winning a competition, you're naturally going to get targeted anyway. So 
do I blame him? Absolutely not. I really don't. Yeah, yeah I have to agree with you. I have to agree with what you guys are saying because he was the first unanimous vote of the season. He went out three to zero. No, he came back to the game. He had no allies, and everyone's targeting him. JP, can you vouch for that? That literally all of you were targeting him right when he came back. Yeah, that is true. I mean, I think it, it was um, it was um, definitely a good idea targeting like uh, I mean like him to win all those comps and survive. But like just going into the game, other than that one um thing he tried to break us up in the beginning with three monkeys. Um, mm. I really didn't see him playing much social game. I mean, because, like, I feel like he just made himself a target by winning this comp early on. But, like, I feel like he could have prevented us targeting him if he didn't win, like, second or first HUH. <laughs> I mean, but, like, I, I'm, like, he wouldn't have to win the battle back, but, like, I still think he played a phenomenal game and um, coming back afterwards. So, there are no more thoughts. I guess we can move on to our next member of the final three, which is... Smooth. <laughs> Ew, boo. Match play, you're very, I'm you're very... Sorry, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. Um, I was gonna say match play. You're very vocal about. I'm your, kidding. Uh, um. Oh. I mean, yes. Like, I wish he would have been evicted instead of me. But I mean, um, uh, clearly, clearly, he must have done something to where he must have made a lot of people want to keep him in the game. I guess maybe people viewed that he was valuable. Um, compared to other people in the house, so, I mean, good for him, I guess. I mean, I wish I would have stayed, but, you know, good for Smooth, I guess. Someone saw me. I'm I not! Didn't. I'm kidding! I know, I'm, no. kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, too, I'm kidding, too. So, um, it seems a lot of people here, raise your hand if you did have an alliance with Smooth. I think it's been a while, so, <laughs> I, I, I was not... I wasn't gonna be 100% low, but kinda, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, seems like a lot of people had a lot of Uh, JP's, JP yeah. himself, like, often cheered for Smooth in the competitions, and he knew when he couldn't win that Smooth would be that second, like, leg for him to win. G JP, do you think that, um, do you think that was more of just him being like a shield for you or like an ally or do you think he's actually played a phenomenal game? I, I, I think he played a phenomenal game. Uh, he's, he's proven himself in comps. I feel like he actually is doing pretty, he's doing well with the Alliance. I think he's actually good. He was the reason why I like, most of us were in the game. So I mean, because he went up the I mean, I, I, even though I saved him a few times from the comps, I think he- I am dead. <laughs> he's still on more like comps comp wise. He did mix moves. Um, I feel like out of the three, he's the most deserving, but like, um, I don't know. I think he did his fair share. He convinced oh, some people true. to do certain things. I think he played a phenomenal game. So many people think that he kind of manipulated a lot of people. He won a lot of comps. He, he did win the most comps up until, you know, Killer came back. But do you, well, I actually, I'll save that question for when we get to the third finalist, but People think, um, oh crap, do you guys think he's made it this far just because people think, hey, he could be a shield that could try, because he's the only one that has been shown to be a rival to killer in competition, so it's, is it fair to say that he's just been kept here because people think, hey, if we keep him, he might be able to beat killer? That is very true, because that's one of the reasons why. We kept him. We kept him instead of the other people. Like instead of like, I forgot who was nom, but like, that's why we kept him because be he, he can he can win comps, and I think that would also help us because he he'd probably be our best chance in the place. But then again, I mean, not to blame. But I think Killer. One of the reasons why Killer wasn't out early on is kind of my fault for not nominating him, nominating him over Timo. But like, yeah. Hmm. Well, we've had a lot of insightful comments on Smooth now. So it's time to move on to our final um, member of the final three. We have 64 Digi Man. Lulzy, why should um, why should Digi win this game? Social game. Very insightful comments from Lulzy. <laughs> um, um, 
Anyone else? Why should Digi win this game over the two comp beasts of the season? Um, I, I, it, I, I mean, in my opinion, yeah, there's gonna be a hard. I don't, I don't. I mean, in my opinion, I don't, I don't see winning because he, he didn't stand out as much as the, as the other two. But I feel like Digi did play a pretty good social game. I feel like he did have some insight on Kelly going home, and I feel like he does have a deserve a chance to win the game. But then again, compared to the other two, um, winning more comps and stuff, like it's gonna be hard for like, people to like see that. And I feel like I don't know, it's gonna be weird going in the long run game. That's true. There's another question: Do the outshine like um some, like social game? Because Digi did only win what two comps, one comp. One he comp. only won. He only won one. So. The problem is with his social or with this one comp win, it kind of just reiterates this fact that he didn't have safety almost every week. Kind of like, um, what is it? He didn't have this safety like Smooth and Killer, how they came or how they just keep winning comp after comp after comp. He's had to use his social game to get through. And I don't know what you guys vote, vote off of. I can't say who I would have voted for. Or who I wouldn't for. Um, um, anyway, so this final two is two veterans and one newbie. Do you guys think that will affect anything going forward? Um, I mean, I don't really care. I mean, I feel like if you just if you prove that you could do well this season, like good for you. And I think that. All three of them have given at least a reason or two as to why they are deserving. So, you know, good for them. That's I don't really care true. if you're a veteran or a newbie in this case, you know. That's very true. So, something else that's been pointed out is that kind of contradicting what Master Pi is saying, but uh, people are saying, I'm sorry, but people say coming into the game like. The, People like Digi and Smooth come in with, like, they have their own resume, like, in this festive season. Digi was the second person voted out, and Smooth got fifth place. So people, the question is, did that affect the gameplay this season? Did you guys see Digi as, like, a non-threat, and you saw Smooth as a big threat since they made it far or not far? I didn't see that at all as is a that problem. A or, point? I mean, I mean, for people like that actually cared, I mean, I guess it's a valid point, but, like, me, I didn't really care. You can be a vet or non-vet. It's, it's a new game. I don't care. I don't take personal games like from like past seasons into it. Then, I mean, one point I tried making a fake alliance of us going against the vets just to get out some people, but like, yeah, but it, the vet thing never really mattered. I think at this point, yeah. yeah. So, before we finish off this discussion, I just, I, I think we should just go down the line and say, what are you most likely going to vote off of going into the finals are you going to vote most on strategic games social jp we'll start with you i'm gonna say i'm gonna vote off who i think played the best round game and oh and you also can think. say you if you want you can say your vote storyline story arc like that kind of thing it, can i say who i'm voting what, what you think no well i mean yeah it doesn't matter it's the I jury Oh, um, well, think I think, honestly, in my opinion, I think Smooth played the best game. And like I said earlier, I think I'm going to vote Smooth. But, no. like, at the, I, I don't really know who. Either Smooth or Killer, I think, deserves to win. Most, but, like, Digi also played a good game, so it's going to be kind of hard on that. But, like, yeah. Uh, what's your name? Danny, what, what are you voting off of going into these uh, final few rounds? Social game. Alright, Master, what are you going to vote off of going into these final I think, two rounds? I think, um, I think I'm going to wait until A, who the final two are, and B, on how they answer during questions and, you know, their speeches and everything. So, I just think that's what actually matters. I don't want to have an idea just yet, so that's what I'm going to do. Alright, um, who's, who's next? Oh. Deck. Deck, how are you voting? Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm 
<laughs> Kirby, what are you voting off of? Social game. Alright. Uh, <laughs> LOL, what are you voting off of? Competition gay. There's Not a lot of people voting off competition in the game. That's true. That begs the question, is that the right way to vote? I guess that's how we can finish off this discussion. This is the first season, so you guys should vote for a person that really deserves that title of first winner. So I'm going to give you guys time because, you know, finale is soon, but you guys have a little bit of time to think about who you are going to be voting for to win when the final two comes around. So that's, that's how we're going to end this. If you guys have any final thoughts to say. It's time for the third and final Head of Household. Whoever wins will earn a spot in the final two and make a decision on who will take to the final two and who will be evicted from the house. Jay is currently in the backyard with Killer and Smooth and see who will take it all. Killer, Smooth, welcome to part three of the final Head of Household competition. Digi. Since you were unable to win part one or two, you are ineligible to compete. This competition is called Scales of Just Us, and here is how it works. You will answer questions about the jurors this season. The answer will either be A or B. Get the answer right, you earn a point. The house guest with the most correct answers after six questions will be the final head of household. All right, let's hop into it. Question one. Danny said... My closest ally in the game was A. Kirby or B. Decked. Your answers are locked in. Let's see what Danny said. My closest ally in the game was Kirby. Which makes the correct answer A. You both got it right, you both get a point. Moving on to question two. Masterfy said, The most shocking moment in the house was A. The jury buyback or B. The double eviction. Alright, you're locked in. Let's see what Masterfy said. The most shocking moment in the house was the double eviction. Masterfy said B, making that the correct answer. You both get it wrong. We are still tied one to one going into question three. Lolzy said the most shocking decision made by a house guest this season was A, smooth using the veto on killer, or B. Digi voting me out. Alright, you're both locked in. Let's see what Lolzy said. Uh, the most shocking decision was Digi voting me out. You have both gotten the question correct. The correct answer is B. Move it, you're tied two to two. Going into the fourth question. Kirby said, My biggest move this season was A. Using the veto on Digi, or B volunteering to leave so my alliance could stay. You're both locked in. Let's see what the correct answer is. My biggest move was volunteering to leave. That makes the correct answer B, which means smooth. You have gotten it, right? Smooth, you are now leading with three points, killer with two. Deck said, the person I wish stayed in the game longer was A, Timo, or B, Danny. You're both locked in. Let's see what the correct answer was. Alright, that makes the correct answer A, Timo, which means killer. You have gotten it correct. You are both tied. Three to three going into the final question. JP said, My biggest regret in the game was A, not aligning with killer to take out smooth, or B, nominating Timo instead of killer. Alright, you've both locked in with separate answers, which means whoever gets this right will be the final head of household. Let's see what JP said. My biggest regret is that I nominated Timo over Killer. That makes the correct answer B. Congratulations, Killer. You are the final head of household of the season. Take a few moments to figure out who you are going to be voting out and who you are taking with you to the final two. Killer became the final HOH of the season. When we come back, I'll be reviewing who wins favorite house guests and who will kill or evict from the house. You do not want to miss this. Stay with us.
Welcome back to Big Brother Minecraft. It's time to reveal who wins favorite house guests and will take home the $25,000 grand prize. Let's bring out the top three who has a chance to win. Now it's time to reveal who is favorite house guest. But let's see who's our three top go getters. Our top three are Deck, JP, and Jay. <laughs> so you three are your. You managed to make it to the top three with over. <laughs> 541 votes total. Oh my god. Whoa. <laughs> Alright. Now it's time to find out who is going to be favorite house guest with 176 votes. Oh my god. The winner is. JP! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Congratulations, I JP. Won. You are this season's favorite house guest, and you'll be. Wait, what? Yeah, I won. Your favorite house guest. I won. And you're taking home twenty-five thousand dollars. <laughs> Congratulations. I won. I won. Favorite house guest. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Congratulations to JP for winning favorite house guests. Congratulations, dude. And now it's time to find out who will kill or evict from the house. Let's go to the living room and see who will kill or decide. No, right. oh, that's my lucky chair. <laughs> <laughs> kill you, you guarantee right. a spot in the final two. And you have a decision to make. Yes. It's to evict either Digi or Smooth. Whoever you decide to evict will become the seventh and final member of the jury. And whoever you decide to bring will face you in the final two. All right. I understand. I understand. So I'm born to evict still. Like I'm saying, I vote yeah, to evict. You're, you're, yeah, you're making your decision of who you want, you want to I'm evict. breaking the tie. You're breaking of the tie. <laughs> I'm breaking so the tie. Of the yep. All right. So. So to evict. Be before I say that, I want to give each person a reason that they... Even though they haven't done this to me, but I want to give each person a reason why I should <laughs> vote to keep them in. Smooth right. your first. Okay, cool. Um, so basically, through this entire game, I mean, you were going for JP. I'm... Basically, I mean, you played a great game. I can't really say anything against it, but you just did great this entire game. I did give you red. Remember that? But, uh, no. But to be honest, <laughs> this was a lot of fun. That's in my mind. I mean... If you take Digi, then go ahead, it's your choice. If you take me, I would really appreciate it. But if you take Digi, either way, I'm cool with it. No All feelings. right, Digi, you're next. Uh, so I just want to say that this has been a blast playing with the two of you. Um, I ain't really got nothing bad to say about Smooth. Uh, we all have played a better, well, not bleh. We have all played a really great game to make it this far. And no matter with what you choose, I am happy that I was able to play this with uh, you, Smooth, and everyone else that was part of the cast. All right. So, this is probably one of the harder decisions in my mind, because both of you have positive, both of you have negatives. But what I think, 100% believe, what I think will help my game so I took someone who I know I possibly can beat. So smooth. I'm sorry. Played a great game, but yet I'm choosing to evict you, smooth. Yeah, that's okay. Right. It's official. Yeah. <laughs> 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 can I have a hug? Smooth. No. Yeah. Oh, God. I hate all of you. <laughs> <laughs> can I have a hug? Oh, sorry, dude. Sorry, dude. Here, uh, fist, you bump. Can have this. fist bump. Fist bump. Smooth. Fist bump. <laughs> yeah. All right, smooth. Make your way out of the house. Bye, smooth. Smooth. The engineer was evicted and became the seventh and final member of the jury. When we come back, the jury and pre-jury Haskus joins with me on stage, and the jury will be asking the final two questions on one of them should win Big Brother Minecraft. You do not want to miss this. Stay with us.
Welcome back to Big Brother Minecraft. The jury and pre-jury haskets are here, and the jury will be asking the final two questions on why one of them should win Big Brother Minecraft. Danny, you may start. Killer, why should you win the game? He should win the game because he was eliminated very early on and was forced to battle his way back in the game, and he has not wasted his second chance. He's won every comp that is needed to get him further in the game, and he has single-handedly split up the Triple Threat Alliance. It was it not it, it was no one else's uh, move but his own. He did what was necessary to get himself farther, and he's overall just had a great game. And he thinks that you should give him his vote, your vote. Um, did you? Some people of the jury believe that you haven't been doing that much throughout this entire game. Tell them why the jury is wrong. Well, even though I, it doesn't look like I've been doing much, like competition-wise, I've only won one comp, but all the work that I put into, my, into this season has been behind the scenes uh, talking and socializing and strategizing with people. If it wasn't for that, I think I might have went home early on in the game. And because I have been socializing, I've gained trust and friendship with everybody, which kept me further into the game. Deji, it seemed that Killa has a bigger resume when it comes to comps. Why should he win when his, or why should you win when his resume is so much bigger? Honestly, this game is so much more than just winning comps. Sure, you can win con, you can win cons throughout the entire game. But have you made any social connection? Have you made any connection to anyone uh, outside of winning just comps? Like you need Jerry management in order to actually win the game. Sure, it'll look good if you win a lot of comps, but in the end, are people gonna vote you just for winning comps, or are they gonna vote for you for doing a lot more than just winning comp. Like, this game is so much more than just comp. I think people should look at the bigger picture than just what people won. Killer, why should we vote you when you already had your chance and you already came back into the game? You guys should vote him even though he came back into the game because he did get eliminated on a weird term. He was the first unanimous vote of the season, and he came back into the game by battling his own way, and he had the whole house against him, which forced him into the position to win all the comps that he needed to to get through. And he thinks that just the fact that he got eliminated should affect your vote, because he's been utilizing his second chance very effectively, and... He has done what he needed to do, and he thinks his resume is big enough that you can look past him winning re-entry to um, get get your votes. All right, DG, as you as you know and I know, you are part of my alliance, the Triple Threat, and um, we all know that Killer was the opposing side of that alliance. Um, what do you think you did that stood out? that we, me and Smooth didn't do that contributed to the Lions and your game? The thing that I did that stood out that helped the Triple Threat Alliance was me making smaller alliances with Kirby and Masterfy, who then voted with us at every single eviction, which then kept us in the game, especially when one of us was either on the block against someone else. And that allowed that person that was on the block to stay safe and remain inside the game. Killer, what'd you do besides winning your way to the end? Smooth. What did you do besides win your way to the end? We knew that you would ask that question. Now that the jury questions are done, Digi and Killer, you'll be making your final plea to the jury on why you should be crowned the winner of Big Brother Minecraft. Digi, you're first. I'm Digi, you're Digi. first. Ladies first. Thank you. Okay. 
So, in this season, I had to adapt my strategy to all the, the twists and situations that happened throughout the entire game. I had to make really hard decisions uh, during the final parts of this. In the test season, I got 12th place. I have improved my game so much. My social was on point. Um, I had made alliances, strong alliances that got me this far. I was able to get people to vote uh, for the person who went home almost every week. I have won one comp. Granted, it's not that many, but I was able to make a move that week when I was HOH. And I have had such a blast playing the game with all of you. Uh, no matter who wins, either me or Killer, I had a blast. I hope we all can be friends at the at the end of this. And I hope we can all still talk after the season's done over with. Thank you. All right. And Killer, you're next. So, Jury. I have played a... A fearless game. I made moves that people would be probably scared here to make. I did not go behind and like talk to everyone, I'm trying to keep myself safe. I made sure that I I did not want I did not came here to play a okay I did not came here to play a safe game. I came here to play the game I wanted to do, which is fearless. I've won competitions. I've won the first H O H the second H O H. Even though it's one of the more deadly HOAs to win. And I have won veto comps. This this may have gotten me voted out or evicted, but yet I came back and proving that I am a threat that you guys should have waited one more week to, to get out. Thank you. Alright, thank you, Final Two. Alright, Jury, you will be making your final decision on who will win Big Brother Minecraft. You'll be placing the key in the hopper. Danny, you're first. Voting for the one that played the best game. Thank you, Danny. MacArthur? I'm voting for who I think deserves it the most. Thank you, MacArthur. Lolzy? Yeah, I'm voting for whoever didn't get stuck in holes. Thank you, Lolzy. Kirby? Hi, oh, I'm, I'm Kirby. And keys and stuff. Thank you, Kirby. <laughs> Decked? Hi, I'm Decked, and I'm voting for whoever worked better. Like Miley. Oh my god. Thank you, Decked. So JP? Yeah. Hi guys, I'm I'm JP. I run track in like varsity cross country. Um, I'm voting for, you know, the person that I think was just a great guy overall. Uh, Thank you, JP. And finally, Smooth. Hi, I'm Smooth, and I'm voting triple threat. <laughs> Thank you, America. Good night. Thank you, Smooth. And with that, the voting is now closed. While we come back, is the moment that you that you guys are waiting for. Either Digi or Killer will be named the winner of Big Brother Minecraft Season 1 and will take home the $500,000 grand prize. You do not want to miss this moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to Big Brother Minecraft. After 57 days of power struggle, alliance forming, and bitter arguments, it's time to crown the winner of Big Brother Minecraft. Digi, Killer, I'll be reviewing the jury's votes. The winner will take home $500,000, and the runner-up, $50,000. I'll be pulling the keys from the box of who each juror votes to win Big Brother Minecraft. You need at least four votes to win. Oh my God. First vote is from Danny, and he casted for Digi to win Big Brother Minecraft. Mo. Oh. <clears throat> MacArthur has cast his vote 
Oh. For Digi to win Big Brother Minecraft. <laughs> Next vote is from Wolvie. And he cast his vote for Killer to win Big Brother Minecraft. That is two votes Digi, one vote Killer. Don't have the buttons. Kirby has casted his vote for Digi to Sorry, win Big Killer. Brother Minecraft. I had to vote for my lines, remember? Yeah, of course. I'll play three Deck more. has cast his vote for Killer to win Big Brother Minecraft. I am surprised. Three I, votes and I wish people could say they're surprised about my vote. Everyone shut up! Shut up, shut up! And I wish they could say that the All right. thing was surprised. JP! Everyone shut up! Sorry. JP! Has cast his vote for... Oh. Killer to win Big Brother oh. Minecraft. So it's oh my god. Three votes, Digi. Three votes, Killer. Oh, which good means... luck, dude. Last good luck, dude. Decides it. Oh, I'm really gonna decide Boo. it. Oh has cast his vote for. Congratulations, Digi. You are the winner of the Big Brother Minecraft Season 1. Uh, good job, dude. Good job, Killer. You play a really excellent game. Alright. Congratulations to Digi for being crowned the winner of Big Brother Minecraft Season 1. Congratulations, dude. And because of you guys making this happen, Season 2 will be happening. Here's how you can be a house guest for next season. Outgoing. Oh my god. <laughs> the three monkeys jump up. <laughs> my little monkey. Outspoken. Oh, how about triple threat? I, li I, li I like that. I like it. I like it. And outrageous. You said that you were voting the same way. Oh, as you told me. No, I did not. Big Brother Minecraft is coming back for another season full of unforgettable moments. Do you have what it takes to move into the Big Brother Minecraft house? Signups are in the description down below to see if you have a shot for next season. Signups are down below to see if you have what it takes to be a house guest. Thank you so much for making this season a great season. And to end season one off, here is a message from Andrew Yellow. From outside Robster's Big Brother house, I'm Andrew. See you guys next season. If you do, Robster, if you add that, if you add that in, oh my god, this is so funny. Here's a special message. I didn't even see what he did. I